Hello everybody, this is Crimson Shinobi here. We're back again playing Dying Light. And I got some good news. I actually went ahead and picked up Dying Light 2, but of course I'm actually going to still play through this before I even touch it. Just like with Resident Evil Village, I just recently picked that one up too. I ain't going to touch it. Us, we were left off. A guy blew himself up in a bullshit fortress. Anyways, let's get this game going. On my way. What you're doing. Are you Tolga and Fatine? Yes. How did you surmise that? Who cares how his ape brain processes information? We have a job for him. Quite right, Tolga. Remember, simple words only. Don't confuse him. We need really to guys. move some equipment across town. It's very heavy. Don't... How heavy? <laughs> <laughs> Too heavy for you, Simeon Beast. Instead, we will propel it across the sky using heavy gauge zip lines. <laughs> a brilliant idea, don't you think? That was my idea. No, it wasn't. Just tell me what you need. Well, hooks, obviously. How else can we hang the equipment off the lines? You will find them at the train yard warehouses. Does he know what a warehouse is? Probably not. Look it up, but be quick about it. This project is far more important than anything your proto-human cranial cogitator is capable of understanding. And don't try to figure out what it is. No. Oh. Heavens, no! You'd give yourself an aneurysm. Okay. Hey, you been looking for a runner? Well, we're looking for one who will say yes instead of no. Jafar can fill you in. What are you saying? But do you think Dr. Zeus is smarter than Cornelius? Yes, obviously. Orangutans were the smartest. Hey, you want to try calming down long enough to tell me what's wrong? Yeah, sure. Let's try that. Calming down will work. Yeah, calming down will solve everything. Oh. No, walking away from you will solve everything. Okay, okay, hang on. I'm chill. I'm chill, bro. So, I make these flares for a rise, right? Wait, flares? Like, like signal flares? No, no, UV flares. Like flares that the night things can't stand because they put out this UV, which stands for ultraviolet. Yes, which is like I know. kind of a science thing. I got it. UV flares. Continue. There is no continue. My zinc is contaminated with fluorine. It's useless. Also, I'm out of turpentine, which isn't that hard to find. Except everything's hard to find right now. So when Rice's people come for their merchandise. Oh. Is he using people now? I thought he only used hired psychopathic gorillas. What do you need to make these things? Just zinc and turpentine, bro. I got the rest. Worst part is everything I need is in the train yard warehouses. But <coughs> a guy like me isn't going to last 10 seconds out there. Well, I'm surprised a guy like you's lasted that long in here. Oh, the, oh that's very funny. Ha ha. Very funny, funny man. Maybe I'll get your supplies, but if I do, Whatever you can make out of them, I take half. Half? No way! You're freaking nuts, bro! Look, you can give me half of something, or you can keep 100% of nothing. Half it is. It seems fair. Shh. 
shit, it's you again? I mean, uh, what are you doing here? Relax, relax. I don't work for Rice. That was a one-time job, and it was all about protecting the tower. Look, I'm sorry. I mean it. Do I Is see that right? that? Look, everything I was doing, I was doing for Brecken. You can ask anyone on the tower if you don't believe me. <clears throat> so what do you got, Jafar? We've been picking up some of Rice's transmissions. One of his crews found something at the construction site, and they got very excited. They didn't say what it was, <laughs> but they referred to bringing down the entire tower in one shot. Someone's got to find out what it is, and either confiscate it or destroy it. Well, I'm someone. Congratulations. The job is yours. <clears throat> we'll be in touch. <coughs> And the night hunt begins. Laurie looked like night to me. Quarantine level for this one. <clears throat> Wait, how far off is? Oh, I'm actually not that far. Look over there! Oh. 
What the hell? I'm I had a headshot. Wait, wait, does that, <clears throat> wait, I have duct tape, does that mean I can craft the almighty golf club again? I think it was fucking awesome. Yes! Yes, I can. Yes.
<clears throat> Some dynamite. Eh, I'm already here. Might as well turn to a safe zone. Two hit wonder. Come in. What is it? So you remember me? I know I remember you. You were at the Rice's camp when I lost my hand. You were one of Brecken's guys. If you were anyone else, I'd kill you. Oh, lucky me. That's right. As for Rice, I'd settle with that psycho in my own time. But first, I need your help to find my brother, Nazim. He's the one who helped me escape. He went for food at the supermarket. He hasn't been back since. I'll pay you to find him. What do you intend to pay me with? Are you kidding? My brother and me work for Rice. You know what that means? Collecting stuff. That's all we ever did. We look for stuff. We find stuff. We take stuff. Well, we wound up with a lot of stuff. Some of it we turn over to Rice. Some of it we kept ourselves. You know, in case things got too crazy. Not like stealing, but protecting for the future. That's just smart, right? Until you got caught. We still got plenty left. Weapons, medicine, money. We've got stashes all over the city. But now Rice's men are looking for us, so I have to be careful going out. So we've got a deal? <sighs> I'll think about it. It will be worth your while. I promise. I remember getting your arm chopped off, but when the hell did you get it? That black eye? I think
Sorry, I had to get that out of my system. I'm starting to notice that some of these zombies have pus looking things growing on them. I wonder if we can drown a zombie. I hear you cackling over there. Eh, might as well go find that lavender. I assume lavender is blue looking. So look for blue shit. They're blue or purple, I guess. I don't remember how many I. I don't know, it's mushroom, but I'll take it. Ah, there is my lavender. Alright, picked up one. I don't remember how many I need. Guess I'll just pick up any I come across. How many do I need? Yes, but how many? Six. All right, I got two. There's three. There's four. Come on, two more. Or if I can go fishing on the second one, that'd be kind of cool. <laughs> oh, how do I get up here? 
That looks like a light. I'm Neil Fallon. I'm a journalist for International Affairs magazine. Yeah, I've heard of you. You have? How the hell'd you get in here? It wasn't so hard during the first few days of the quarantine. And when they put Suleiman in charge, it was pretty clear how things were going to go. So you decided to stick around? Actually, I've decided to leave. Though God knows how that's gonna happen. I've been in some lockdown cities before, but there's usually someone you can bribe. Not here. I can't get you out of Haran. I'm not sure anyone can. No, of course. But I've been documenting this place pretty much from day one. I've interviewed hundreds of, well, people who aren't people anymore. Suleiman has a lot to answer for. The world needs to know what's happened and, look, I'm kind of desperate here. I've lost my work, all of it. I was holed up at an internet cafe when a mob of infected landed on me. I got out without a bite, but I left my satchel at the cafe. And everything's in the satchel? Most of it. They chased me for a while, so I finally had to ditch my camera in a car. Look, I know it's a lot to ask. All right, even if I recovered them, you still don't have a way out of here. Mister, if I can't get my work back, there's no reason for me to get out. Now, that cafe's in a bad area. I'll... I'll think about it, but no promises, okay? So I gotta climb that. I'm sure there's a way you can swim fast. Oh, okay, never mind, there it is.
guess it's time to do some ninja shit. Up I go. Could end terrible. Alright, this one. We're not. Ow. Thank you. 
Hey, do you like heights? Uh, if you don't like heights, I'm terribly sorry for what you're witnessing. Not really. I mean, I sure as hell wouldn't do this shit in real life. Fuck that. Okay. The ones with green. Touch only the ones with green. Oh, I can keep going, huh? Alright. Now here's my question. How the fuck do I get down? Oh, this better be worth it. Something good better be in here. This is what is Assassin's Creed, and this is my perch. Well, here goes nothing. Oh. 
Well, that's all time I have for this one. Well, climbed one of the tallest things in the game I could imagine. And jumped it. Interesting. Open a lot of missions, so it's probably going to take me forever. Anyways, if you liked watching, hit the like button. Feel free to comment down below anything I might miss, anything cool to find that you want to leave me to. Feel generous? Hit the subscribe button. <laughs>